guys welcome back to kala pochana this is vishnu i hope you all are doing good in today's project i am going to upcycle my daughter's dress to match with my crop top for mother's day here is the top that i have for my sari and i don't have the same color for my daughter so i thought for this project i would upcycle one of her white shirts to look something similar like this crop top Here is the white top that I'm going to upcycle so that it looks something similar to my crop top here in blue color and for this project I'm going to use fabric dye I am using fabric dye for the first time hopefully it works out uh, I have read about how to use and I have watched some YouTube videos on how to use the fabric dye so I'm going to follow all that steps first I'm going to dye this uh, white fabric to look something similar in this blue color so I got a blue dye and later i'm going to hand paint all this design on this uh, top so that it looks similar and me and my daughter can do twin dresses for mother's day so here i have a cotton fabric so i'm using this fabric dye which is all purpose fabric dye which i got from joans and i think it's 5 dollars but i applied a 50% off coupon so i got it around 2 dollar 50 cents so i got it in navy blue color uh, which says like if you want like a darker shade i need to use double the size i'm using this fabric dye for the first time so i read all the instructions thoroughly so i'm going to follow the instructions and dye this fabric first later i'm going to hand paint all the roses and leaves that would look similar to my crop top with some uh, fabric paints and paint brushes So it's day 2 of my project. 
here is the blouse that I finished dyeing. Uh, it looks nice. It doesn't look exactly the same as my blouse color, but they almost are same. So I'm happy how the result turned out and it was pretty easy to use the dye and I'm so happy that I learned a new technique how to use the fabric dye with this project. So next step, I'm gonna replicate similar design like my blouse on top of my little one's blouse. I'm gonna create similar roses and some stems so that it looks alike to my uh, blouse. So I'm gonna paint on top of this fabric. Uh, I'm going to hand paint these roses on top of this blouse. First, I'm gonna mark where exactly I want the big roses that you look on this blouse and where we have the rose buds. I'm gonna just mark pointers where exactly I want them and then just hand paint and just have fun how this project is gonna turn out. Here I'm using a wooden hoop so that I can attach it to the blouse and start painting on it. So I'm gonna replicate the same design here onto this top and uh, let's see how the project turns out at the end. So I'll see you guys at the end of this video. one's blouse and it's drying. While it's drying, I'm finishing up her skirt. I'm just stitching a simple basic skirt. 